Disclaimer, these videos are meant to be a brief overview of the subject. They are written to meet time constraints while still conveying factual historical information. My sources for each video are in the video summary below and can get you started on a more in-depth look at the subject. On a personal note, if there is a way to mispronounce the name, I will do it. It is a gift and I am sorry about it ahead of time. Welcome to Things You Should Know, The Great War. Today we're back on the Western Front and the Race to the Sea. Between Germany and France, the battle occurred in Arras, France from October 1st to the 6th, 1914. After the Battle of Albert, German Chief of Staff Erich von Falkenhayn sent the 6th Army under the command of Bavarian Crown Prince Ruprecht to the German Army's right flank in an attempt to flank the French 2nd Army. Unbeknownst to the Bavarian Prince, French Commander Joffrey had organized the new French 10th Army under the command of General Madhu. French 10th Army was intending to flank northward towards Douai. Prince Ruprecht Unaware that the new French forces were in the area and heading in the same direction as his troops, ordered his men to make their attack on October 1st. This would result in a collision of both armies running into each other without much warning. For two days, the fighting was intense, but the German 6th Army was slowly winning as they pushed the French 10th Army backwards. This cost the Germans, though, with heavy losses as the Germans attempted to reach Vimy, north of Arras. The town of Arras itself was caught in the middle of both armies and devastated. On October 4th, the Germans finally had taken Vimy and the defensive positions they offered. The French command, realizing the precarious position they were in, made General Ferdinand Falk the command of the entire Northern Army Group. This included both the 10th and 6th French armies, and they began a counterattack that dissolved when the French armies hit the German defenses. On October 5th, French forces began to slowly push the Germans back, stopping a new Bavarian division at the Belle Isle. The French, hoping they could use this to help their counterattack, moved forward with ambitious orders to advance north of Arras. After several more days of fighting, on October 9th, the battle had lessened into a dull roar and became more static as both sides continued to leapfrog north to the sea. Neither side had taken the town of Arras. There are no organized casualty lists for this battle, but once again, we can be sure it was a meat grinder just like the previous ones. Join us again next time on Things You Should Know, The Great War.